As I film this video, the Yankees are down four to nothing in the second inning. Jamison Tyone just didn't have it today. The sticky substances being removed from the ball may have hurt his performance. I don't know. He's best friends with Garrett Cole. You tell me if there's a correlation. But the Yankees got some more bad news, and I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but Luis Severino, who was making his second start in his rehab coming back to the Yankees, has injured himself again. According to Lindsey Adler, he had to be helped off of the field after taking an awkward step, and he appeared to be, in quote, a lot of pain. That's not good. Just yesterday, Brian Hoke said on my podcast that he expected Luis Severino to be back later this month, possibly early July, and that he would definitely beat Corey Kluber back to the rotation. Now you have to wonder, how bad is this leg injury? The range of possibilities with a leg injury are enormous. And as a pitcher, your legs are so important. Not only do you drive off of the mound with your legs, but you land on your legs and you have to balance yourself with your legs. And any kind of problems with your legs can affect your arm. Specifically, your shoulder is going to bear a brunt of that issue. And the Yankees don't want to have any shoulder issues with Luis Severino. Could also be elbow issues if your legs are not working right. So they're probably going to shut down Luis Severino. I'd be surprised if we see him again anytime soon. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news. Life is a carnival of pain. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. It helps other Yankees fans find the channel. If you really enjoyed it, check out the swag section. We've got tons of great designs to support all your favorite Yankees. And if you simply cannot get enough Yankees content, check out the podcast version of this channel, The Freeze by 